So, during this week there's a demo available for the upcoming WC10 to release in, uh, I believe, September. I downloaded it and these are my first impressions. You will see all three stages that are available, which are Spain, Estonia and the new rally of Croatia. Spain and Croatia being Tarmac rallies and Estonia being Gravel. So, let's start with some negative points that I have to say first. Because it was quite an issue getting this game to run. There was a lot of flickering, there was a lot of screen tearing, which, which made it unplayable, really. Um, I had to Google a bit, found that they recommend a certain driver from last year to put on your NVIDIA card. Um, so I did that, that fixed the issue with the stuttering and it was a real issue to get my Thrustmaster set up. Um, I also reinstalled the driver, driver there because the game didn't recognize it properly, then it recognized two different wheels and still in the end it didn't recognize my handbrake. So I was, uh, uh, I mapped the handbrake to a left shift a pedal and drove like that. I, it was too much of an issue. So much for the setup. Um, then I got into the first rally, which was Estonia on gravel, and I want to highlight some positive things, which are stage design. Actually, um, the, the the way the road is lay, laid out, the, the way the um, corners are chained together, how how different let's say f track features like widening the track bridges co uh, ch chicanes and stuff how they are all put together across all three locations this is this is quite nice it, it makes the whole stage feel like a real place from the design aspect like how the road is laid out also a positive thing and i was surprised i can say this are the physics um, I had the f uh, I, ha I had force feedback through the wheel, um, which gave me enough information to, from the front wheels to judge how to move the car and all. And they generally felt very drivable from a physics standpoint. I even would say the tarmac physics are a notch above um, Dirt Rally 2.0. I have to say they are also force feedback issues whenever I restarted a stage um, the force feedback got all weak uh, all of a sudden so I don't know there, there was an internal reset that didn't quite work properly but when you launch a stage freshly it felt quite nice from the physics standpoint it g gave you a lot of control over the car Still though, uh, in this video you might see me drive not to the standard of this channel you might be used to because I literally drove those stages for the first time. Uh, I didn't know what was coming. I also drove those cars for the first time. So next thing, um, next issue I found was that apparently there is no rain on the windscreen. When it rains there is a button set up to uh, activate your wipers to uh, turn them on and off but there there are no drops on the windscreen so there's no reason even in the rainstorm to ever put on your windscreen wipers um, which seems odd yeah the most frustrating thing though was the performance um, because I, I set it up to run at 60 FPS and on 4K resolution it didn't feel fluid at all um, and it, my PC can run such settings on Dirt Rally 2.0 not on highest settings but it can run it smoothly so I would hope for this to be an option for me to actually get and play that they improve the performance so you can actually run it smoothly um, secondly yeah the graphics are not good I would say um, yeah 
you can see w w what what's meant to be there but from a perspective that we have 2021 and new consoles have released and there is a Forza Horizon 5 trailer out then you compare these graphics and you think hmm could be better could be better there are some tries uh, to make it look awesome I even noticed one of those drone shots in the replay but um, yeah if you look at one from Dirt Rally 2.0 you maybe find some differences there. Yes. And last, last but not least, uh, I hope that the stages that are included are only like the short version of a location and not the longest version because like between six and eight kilometers per stage is not enough to capture the rally feeling, I think. Uh, in a proper way because you don't have to keep up your concentration for such a long time it's quite easier to just keep it up for four minutes and not for like 10 minutes so overall my impression is um immortal joe would say mediocre yeah some good points like the physics and uh, the actual force feedback that comes uh, through and the stage design and uh, sadly also a lot of bad points that sour the whole experience and actually make it a whole lot less immersive for me than Dirt Rally. I am honestly, if, if it stays in this stage, I'm not sure if I can get it or if I want to get it. Um, uh, and therefore if you will see more of this on the channel, um, but we'll see, maybe they make improvements and it gets better. What you will see more of coming November, I'm quite sure, is Forza Horizon 5. Which might give you a sign on the horizon when actual um, racing content on this channel is uh, guaranteed to resume. Also, I'm still looking forward in, I guess, two years when Codemasters gets the WRC license and... Uh, takes a take on what they can do with it although I'm not sure about what I think about that electronic arts purchase because yeah as far as reputation goes like they are at, at, at the bottom of my scale like like right at the bottom of all the gaming studios yeah so let's see how that goes anyway I will leave you with the rest of the footage uncommented so you can hear the co-pilot and see the graphics and stuff for yourself. And I wish you have a beautiful and nice day. I've been Skyrex. Cheers. A two turn in left 100. Narrows into right three short. Into left two and right left two. Into left right two, medium, into right one, short, 20. Into left one, medium. And right one. Left two, short, into right two, and left two. Right two, short, into right two, tightens, and left one, medium. Into right one, short, 30. Into right, left, one, short, into hairpin, right, short, 30. Left, two, widens. Into right, four, long, 30. Right, four, short, into left, two, don't cut, tightens, into right, three. Into left, four, and left, four, short. Into right four, medium, tightens. Left three, short, into right three, keep in. Into left two, medium, tightens. Into right three, opens, and right three, keep in. Into left three, opens. Into junction, flat right, 80. Flat right, into left five.
to write five short and left three long. Into right four short, don't cut. And left three short, into right three long. Into left three short, into right three short, tightens, into left two. Right three, tightens. Three into left four tightens. And right three tightens into left two. Into right four opens and finish.